Hi there, all you hot dog fans and all you hot dog questioners, and welcome to How Hot Dogs Are Made. Photos of hot dogs. I know a lot of you out there have been wondering for a long time now, how exactly are hot dogs made? No BS, no fluff, no fake news, just some good old fashioned food facts. In this video, we're going to take you behind the scenes and into the factory. So let's show you how it all goes down, starting with cleanliness. I was actually pretty surprised to see all the work put into keeping everything so pristine and clean. From the floors to every human walking through the doors, including us. Every person has to wash their hands for at least 20 seconds every single time they enter, which feels like a really long time. Plus you have to get geared up in approved protective wear. Cleanliness is clearly top of mind. Turns out it has to be. Government regulations mandated. That's why factories across the US have on-site USDA inspectors. And yeah, I'm sure you're thinking, that's all great, everything's clean. But let's talk about the one thing everyone always wants to know. What exactly is in a hot dog? Well, ready for the big reveal? It's meat, good meat, great meat even. No scraps, no leftovers, we're talking choice cuts of meat. The kind that you would be happy to eat as the main event for any meal. Which kind of shocked me actually, considering all those mystery meat rumors I've heard. Plus, we learned it's virtually impossible to make hot dogs with anything but quality cuts of meat because of that government inspector we mentioned before. USDA. And I'm sure you're thinking, seriously? Turns out, yeah, seriously. Those inspectors are in the factories day in and day out, making sure only healthy cuts of beef, pork, turkey, and chicken are the only products going into America's hot dogs. And that's just the beginning of the process. Next up, a step called milling, which simply means mixing it all together. The meat is ground down in these massive stainless steel mixing containers with high-speed choppers. Then spices like garlic, white pepper, and paprika are added, giving the dogs that great frankfurter taste. Ice is then added to keep the mixture cool, and all of the ingredients go through the delicate process of milling this mixture down into a batter. The batter is then placed in a linking machine, and it's here where the hot dog is formed into its iconic shape. Caption, wiener. And last, but certainly not least, the final step smoking. During this step, the linked hot dog strands are moved into a large smokehouse and perfectly cooked under controlled conditions, infusing the dogs with the flavor from the wood. After that, the dogs take one last bath, allowing for the casings to be gently removed. Steamy. From there, they are packaged, placed in a refrigerated truck, and ready to be delivered to your favorite restaurant or grocery store. As you can see, even the best chefs in the world would have a pretty tough time making a hot dog from scratch. It's not an easy process and takes a lot of time, effort, and care. But in my humble opinion, it's worth every bite. We hope this sneak peek into the secret world of hot dogs made you feel better about chomping down on a dog. I know it did for me, and now I can finally answer the age-old question of how hot dogs are made.